up, Tactics Bar? You already know who it is. It's your boy, Manny's Revolution. If you didn't know, well, now you know. My name is Manny Fernandez. You can find me on Instagram under Manny's Revolution. I am based out of Las Vegas, Nevada. Those of you that know me, I like to paint a lot. I'm always creating, so I love Tattoo Smart because it helps me create faster. And that's what it's all about, efficiency. You know what I'm saying? Are you guys excited for today? Are you ready to get Tattoo Smart? Stop wasting your time. Stop wasting your time. Smart Tattooing is Tattoo Smart. Let's get started. Let's get to the... Nitty gritty. What I want to do today is kind of talk about my process. How I get it done quick. How I do color studies here and there. How sometimes I use color hues and things like that to help me where I'm kind of stuck in areas that I feel I can't figure out. I want to teach you guys how to be able to do a drawing and print it out so all the lines are not super fat. They're tattooable and it's actually the right size as you can see. So it can fit the body 100%. Hopefully little joker doesn't come by today. I told him I was going to be making a video for Tattoo Smart and he's been bugging me all day. He's super excited about it but I really hope he doesn't come by because he might get in the way of this tutorial. Alright, well, let's get started. Oh shit. What's up, little joker? Hey, what's up, money? What are you doing, loco? What's happening? I told you I was making a video for Tattoo Smart. You're making a video for Tattoo Smart? Orale, that's what's up, babe. You know I gotta take every chance I get so I can be on TV, man. Come on, Benny. You know I love learning from you and all this entrepreneur stuff. It makes me like, it gives me goosebumps. Orale, alright. It makes me creep out, eh? Come on, man. Let me watch, man. I'll be quiet, man. Let me introduce myself. My name is Nacho Fernandez, but everybody calls me Little Joker. First of all, I want to give a big shout out to Russ Abbott. Like, for real? You the man, homie. For real. Like, I even went and got the TS tatted on me, you know what I'm saying? You know what that stands for, right? Tattoo Smart Representative, homie, all right, eh? All right. And one more thing, take a good look at my good side, homie. Every side is good, homie, all right, all right. But not as good as Tattoo Smart tools, you know what I'm saying? All of this project was to do a piece that was 22 inches, which is normal for a sleeve, by 7 inches, which is my arm. And when I printed it out, it was kind of big because I didn't really have a person I was putting it on. I put it up to my arm, realized it was really big, so I went and resized it for you guys and printed it out. I will measure from here to here, which normally is around 22 to 23 inches. And so I'm from here to here, it's around 12 inches, depending on the person. Now we know that from this point and this point, it's 23 inches. From this point to this point is 12 inches. They were like, I want to get a sleeve of some flowers. Get one tattoo smart flower like that. This is a, a peony set from Wes. Be and you know, you can be lazy and just tattoo this just like that. But that's not the point of tattoo smart. It's to help you create stuff faster, but still be original. So let's try to change this up a little bit because obviously you guys have the same flower. Let's get one of these petals. Just a quick little way to change it up. And then copy it. So then from there, you can kind of move it over a little bit like that. Erase those areas you don't want in there. Another petal like that. Erase this. You can go like that. If you wanted to get started real quick, let me show you another little tip. We got these ones right here. Like that. Go like this. And another wave. Got these waves from the Marine Time Volume 1 Tattoo Smart set. Now I'm gonna go and create a better design. More customized. So it's not so stamped. You know what I'm saying? Added some more flow and now I'm gonna do a final line drawing. The little tip is when you do small three round liners try not to do it too small because when you print it out and stencil it sometimes the skinny lines don't come out it's important to have a color study if you haven't been tattooing for more than 10 years you should definitely have a color study and tattoo smart is a great way for you to do it very quickly here's another little tip here the tools you go to here because i'm able to change the colors like the freehand go like that go to the hue and now you can change that top part you get the idea are you homie seriously watching this right now man it's crazy in mind this is a quick color study for this tutorial you can always make it better for your client the more time you take the better it will come out let's say that we're gonna put it on a person that had a body size where the top of the arm was bigger as form and go to work press this little grid down here and move this around until you get the right size if you had to size something up on the fly this would be a good way to do it be able to resize it a little bit and make it fit the person that day without having to reschedule that is smarter not harder man it's crazy but when you go and print this out you go to share you go to JPEG, select your printer, touch the picture, then you go to resize and move, then you go to original size. From there, you move it around like this and you start with the top left. Go like that, and you hit print. Go to resize again, original size, hit print. 